So I love everything Disney. It's not really a secret. And I also am a big list and planner person. So I picked up, I'm so excited. I picked up, look at this. It is a happy planner and it's Disney. So I wanna go through this. We're gonna walk through it together. That way you can understand if you decided that you wanted to pick up this particular one, you're going to know everything you need to know about it. So this here is the classic dashboard layout, and I want to show you what comes in it. So first you're going to have all your Disney characters in a cute little photograph and always find a reason to smile. So this is part of their 100, their Disney 100 line, and this is a 12 month planner January to December of 2024. So the first page is where you are going to be able to put your name. You're going to have a full two year calendar spread. So you're going to have your 24 and your 2025 here and a place where you can put notes here as well. So then we're going to move on to the individual month. Here you'll be able to have all of your months listed and that's going to go on through December. Finally, you're going to go and have at the very beginning, we're going to have January 2024. So you're going to be able to have your list of priorities here, your top three for January, anything important that you need to do and anything you want to take note of. So here in January, we're going to be talking about more love. So you'll see some favorite Disney characters as they're loving other characters. So the we're going to have our full month calendar it does have not only normal holidays like new year's things like martin luther king jr day but you're going to have fun things like national sticker day the 65th anniversary of sleeping beauty the animated version so i love that about all of the disney planners because it really gives you some really fun things to look forward to. So then we're gonna move on to our weekly view. Now this is the dashboard view. This happens to be one of my favorite views because you're going to have tasks. I put tasks that I need to get done in the week. Then you have anything that's important that you need to remember. Looking ahead, so that might be, and I use this section for what is going to happen next week that maybe I'll learn about this week. Any notes down here. So then on this side, you're gonna have your individual days. Maybe there's like, you have a theme for that day. Um, and then here you have a bigger size where you can actually write more about that day. That is what the week looks like and it's gonna go through the entire week of January. So now we're going to move on to, as you can see, you have February here. Now this one is always find a reason to smile. So let's move on to March. Be true to you. This is April. The best things in life are the people we love, the places we've been, and the memories we've made along the way. And I really love that this is from Encanto and this is like the family. So I really love that. Let's move on to May. May, follow your own path. And I, you know what? I like the fact that it has Tiana there and Princess and the Frog, because that's pretty much what the whole movie, in my opinion, was about. Let's move on to June. Be proud of who you are. Daisy, what a classic character. I love her because, you know what, she is very unapologetically Daisy. Let's move on to July. Here's to making memories with cherished friends. And you see different friends here, so that's fun. August, discover your story. I mean, hello, right? I mean, that's literally her whole movie is the fact that she decided to go and figure out what she wants to do with her life and not be conformed into what everyone else thinks of her. I digress. Love this. I can go on for hours. September. Love these moments. Oh, I love this. October. Life is better with friends. Oh, look at them. Oh. This is too cute and I'm actually looking through this for the first time as well. So stay true and embrace your journey. Oh, oh my goodness. They did such a good job picking the, the different characters and the different pictures that they want to use for this. Like this is insane. I love this. Oh, and December. 
collective moments, not things. And that's, I, I think, really something important to remember in December. Okay, so here at the back, you will have a place for notes. And here you can actually use um, this spot here if you want to um, think back about your year, maybe things that have happened, things that you don't want to forget. I love that. And this is the back cover. So one of the cool things about the disc planner system in particular is that if you don't want something with that planner, you can always take it out. You can always put it back in and it's very simple to do that. So if you are looking for a nice planner that happens to be Disney, then pick this one up because this, this is amazing. 